Mercy. Good Mercy. morning. Good morning. Please sit down. How are you guys doing? Yeah, we are doing very fine. Okay, so um, how the uh, daily diamonds is going? It's wonderful. It's going? Yes. Yeah. Are you learning a lot? Yes. You guys are excited about it? Yes. Are you sharing with your friends? Yeah, of course. Is it? Yes. So are they excited? Did they say anything else about it? Yes, the... they were asking what's today's special. Oh, today's special. <laughs> yes. So there's something very special. So um, last uh, we, we, we saw how the baby Jesus came in a natural form. Like um, how we were swaddled by clothes and uh, kept in the manger. Yes. Um, you know, all this process was so, so simple and humble, right? Mm -hmm. So, now this birth of Jesus was given as a sign for a few people to come and meet him, right? One among them is wise men. So, I'm going to talk about wise men later. But now, this wise men, they came and met Jesus and they offered gifts for baby Jesus so normally when you go and meet a newborn baby what you will do you will give them gifts you will give gifts like a clothes yes. right do you remember that uh, when you were born I I brought some gifts for you you did yes uh, and I think um, your father challenged some um, some challenge and he offered money for somebody else I think you know that that's how it will be the birth is so precious right so they were um, they were offering gifts to Jesus Christ so any guess what is the first gift uh, gold gold and yeah. silver no gold the first one is gold you know uh, have you found gold or heard about gold earrings like earrings? So, yeah, people like uh, in nowadays, they put mm, like earrings, yeah. chains, bracelets, you know, so many things, ornaments, it has come. It has come as a indication of wealth, right? Yes. But, you know why this wise man offered gold as a gift to Jesus? No. Because after that, Bible doesn't say that Jesus uh, used that gold to make a chain yeah. or earring or a bracelet. He yes. never wore that thing. But this wise man, they offered as a custom practice. To, um, to think, but it has a very good meaning, very spiritual meaning. You know, gold represents the kingship. What is that? Kingship. Kingship. Royalty. Say royalty. 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 So it, it says that Jesus is a king because they follow the star because the star is a birth of a king. So they know this child, though kept in a manger, He's swaddled a with ordinary clothes, but this child is a king of kings. And that's why the first gift they offered is gold. gold. Gold represents not to, you know, just to give them as a material thing to represent Jesus came into this earth as a king of kings. And that's what the gold means, royalty. Right? Royalty and nobility. Do you understand? Yes. So what does that mean? Royalty <laughs> and nobility. Nobility, right? It shows the kingship of Jesus Christ. We also need to adorn our Jesus as a king. Have you accepted Jesus as a king? Yes. Do you daily worship him as a king? Yes. Viewers, are you worshipping Jesus as a king? Are you giving due respect and honor for this king of kings? Jesus is king of kings. He is lord of lords. He came and chose an humble beginning, but he is a king. Alright? So honor him with all your things and honor this king of kings okay god, god bless, bless you, you.